That's right, Henrietta and Elsie are now in sort of magazine locations due to a lot of people asking for Henrietta like an insane amount. But yeah, finally in the game. And there's more for this update, so let's go over it. First off, there is new faces for Toby, Thomas, Percy, and a couple of the characters. There has been some tweaks to the characters, like all the characters now finally having that white part in their eyes. This leads to a more consistent art style in the game, and I am honestly pretty glad that it's all now consistent. For the update, we have a new mechanic, which is technically already in the game, but I haven't announced it yet. Basically, instead of fiddling with the eye tool, now, for computer users, if you press Shift-P, you get a special free-roaming camera. Now, I, me and my friends, and thank Spiteful Vix for this camera even being in the game, we found this in a call because it's already in one Roblox game. We just looked for it, and we found it. And it's actually a really good camera. Uh, we might change it from being Shift P to Shift C, maybe, but it'll be on the rules board if you're worried what key to press. This is um, a really cool camera. I like the way how you can zoom out and zoom in. It'll be great for shots. You'll just need other people to drive your engines. You also can look in stuff like uh, uh, buildings you had no idea what was in them, or just the Game Pass area if you want. If you go to Timmy Sheds, you might see that we have a new member of the Steam team, and it is actually Bear. Now, adding bear, for some people, they might find it a little weird because Steam Team and you're adding a diesel engine, but bear has been the railway series and I'm pretty glad that he's actually in the game now. Originally planned to be in the base game, but didn't have enough time or even the spot for bear. You might be wondering, hold on a minute, where's Duck? Well, Duck has actually moved to a new spot and he is with Oliver now. Donald and Douglas, you know, later update. <laughs> but we do have some coaches for them. Of course, we have Toad. But we also have Alice, Mirabelle, Isabel, and Dulcie. So, for your Railway Series fans out there, that'll be pretty fun to have the coaches here. You probably know that in the Railway Series that Duck works near Arlesburg West. And while we don't have that, we do have a miniature engine line. Which means that the old area where they used to spawn is now gone. Now, we do have stuff for them to pool and one coach so i hope you have fun with this area for the update you might notice longer or bigger characters and different versions of them well that is because early in alpha these were the original models but now they're bigger because we had to make them smaller to fill in the track since we didn't know how to do bogeys and now they're finally in the game so you can enjoy the original models that were supposed to be in the game at launch also, I decided to retire the Diesel's Ditch thumbnail because I have a better one and it is Daisy at the new station. So, say F in the comments below for the Diesel thumbnail at Diesel's Ditch. Before I go into anything else in the video, I forgot to mention that the game will have themes in certain areas. I was going to include a clip of this, but I'm about to upload the video. I just felt like I should mention this. The themes are by Paul Grennan, so those themes will be uploaded on the YouTube channel in the following days. But yeah, continuing with the video. There is more stuff for the update, but the last thing I'll mention for this video before the update goes live is that the new tunnel area has been made in the game. If you don't know, the New Tunnel Stories was like a arc of magazine stories, and there's a station and a tunnel, and the whole point of it was to build it to just go to places faster. Now, we have made the New Tunnel, and I had to pay very close attention while making this line to be as accurate to the track as possible, because in the story, sometimes it has buffers, and then sometimes it doesn't. It's very inconsistent, so I did the best of I could with the line. So I hope you like it, because not many games really have the new tunnel. But that'll be it for this video. The update will drop today at 3 p.m. EST. I'll do a live stream right before the update comes out on the Gans Post channel, just to have a fun little time with all of you. But that'll be it for this video. I hope you enjoy the new update in sort of magazine locations. I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everyone.